just a quick one uh, gonna fit a rear view mirror to me van it was a panel van obviously I've had it converted uh, seats kitchen full camper windows all around etc lights you name it we've got it now on the back of that I have found it very frustrating the lack of a rear view mirror obviously it didn't really matter before because I couldn't see out the back now I can um, being a van has got loads of blind spots so 12 quid off the old eBay uh, done a little bit of checking just to confirm that it is the right one it's got this sort of nighttime dimmer on as well which I like I like that in my old cars so remove this cap just pulls off you can see the kind of it's hard to see with the light see it there it's got like a cap that fits so that fits inside of there like that Right, I'll admit, I should have checked this beforehand. Um, as pointed out, there's like a nut in the windscreen. There's almost like a, a male end on this side, female end inside the mirror. Uh, I should have checked this earlier. It looks like it actually turns, pushes on and then turns to lock into place before I was trying to sort of slide it over. So I'll try again this time. Um, all I've done differently is spent a second actually looking, which I didn't do before, to be honest. So this time I'm gonna push it on and turn and lo and behold it's locked in place but it's the wrong way around so I'll try that again so that will go uh, I want that to be there like that so that wants to be there then turned I believe so again first time I'm ever trying this so there you go look at that there's my night nine dinner Champion. <laughs>